Hi, my name is Nicole and I am a chaplain at Central Vermont Medical Center. The meditation that I'm going to share with you today was inspired by my calendar this month, which is created by the artists Abacus Corvus in North Carolina. Something that I like to do as a meditation practice is actually gaze at images, so I'm sharing this with you as a practice. I encourage you to go ahead and look at the details of this image. And the message that came with it. When I flipped the page a couple of months ago, a couple of weeks ago, I thought to myself, what a perfect message for this time, for our community and for the world, when so much feels uncertain and frightening, to stand brave. See these two goats balancing on top of one on top of the other and reaching out across this wide divide with a crevice of an unknown depth speaks to my feeling of helplessness so often these days facing our fragility as humans and really having to accept how vulnerable we are. How do you stand brave in that kind of a situation? Like the mountain goat, connecting to what it is that gives us a sense of strength and stability. And meditation is one such thing I'm going to put the image down, but I encourage you to think about what feelings it brought up for you, maybe some other images, words, thoughts. Take note of them and try to let them go. If something comes back to you, then maybe that has an important message for you. But for now, I'm going to encourage you, like the mountain goats, to find a really strong connection with the earth. So whether that's from a standing position, really feeling secure on your two feet, or from a seated position, again, feeling a connection with your feet flat on the ground, your legs and butt on the chair or wherever you're sitting, but if you can, where you are, I encourage you to lie down on the ground so you can really fully connect with that sense of support. Lying down on a blanket or a mat so you can be comfortable, placing a rolled up blanket or a pillow under your knees, supporting your neck if you need to, having your feet about hip distance or a little bit further apart and your arms either down at your side separated away from your body with your palms facing up or you can try having them more overhead if that feels like what you want to do right now but whether you're standing seated or lying down go ahead and close your eyes and pay attention to those points of contact with the earth. Feeling yourself being supported. The soles of your feet, the backs of your legs and your seat. If you're lying down, the back of your head, your whole spine, your pelvis, 
the backs of your legs, your heels, the backs of your arms. Noticing how it feels to be supported by the earth. Feeling that sense of strength, stability, and belonging that can come from connecting with the earth where you are in this moment. And maybe as your attention is brought to those places of contact, you can relax and feel a little bit more supported in your position in each of those points. Noticing where your weight is held the most. Taking one more moment to feel your body connecting with the earth and then bringing your attention to your breath. Letting the breath at first be a cleansing breath. Breathing in, breathing out, letting go of the fear, the grief, the anxiety, the sadness, the anger, whatever else has come up for you during this time, this time of uncertainty. So breathing in and breathing out, exhaling fear, grief, anxiety, And now just noticing the movement of your breath in your body. Noticing how it feels moving through you. Noticing how your breath moving through you changes the feeling of being supported, whether you're standing or seated or lying down. We're going to use the breath to help us to connect more deeply with that sense of safety and security that the earth can offer. With each inhalation, feel a sense of lightness and peace. And with each exhalation, feel yourself becoming more condensed heavier, sinking into the earth. With each exhalation, your body becomes more relaxed, heavier, and denser. With each exhalation, the body is condensing into stone, into the earth. Your body is becoming like part of the mountain. Your fears, your grief, your anxiety, your sadness, your anger floats away as your body becomes more stable, more secure, more supported, becoming more condensed and like the earth. Knowing that at any time that the uncertainty feels like it's taking over, this sense of stability and security is right here for you with your breath and through your connection to the ground and to the earth. With your next breaths, you're going to let your inhalation bring lightness back into your body. Breathing in, expanding, your limbs become lighter. 
your mind becomes lighter. Breathing in, continuing to become lighter and more awake to the world around you. With your next breath in, gently opening your eyes. If you're lying down, stretching your body out, coming up into a seated position. Taking one more breath all together, breathing in, breathing out, knowing that this is here for you anytime that you need it.